Prince of Wales. At long last, Netflix's historical drama gets to the stuff fans have been waiting for. At long last, The Crown arrives at the tragic love story of Prince Charles and Lady Diana Spencer in its fourth season. I'm sorry, we haven't missed. We have. No. No, I was in costume at the time. Sarah Spencer's younger sister. Uh, the mad tree. Diana. Episode 1 shows the pair first meeting when Diana is still very young and while Charles is still dating her elder sister Sarah. Maybe I do. All right, uh, she works part-time at a kindergarten. Oh, she's a teacher. No, for that you'd need actual qualifications. Sarah Spencer, played by Isabel Eady in The Crown, is the eldest of the four Spencer children and did date Prince Charles briefly in 1977, before his courtship of Diana. Would you mind if I asked her out? Out, out? Yes. Gosh. Would you mind? No. Charles and Diana were engaged in 1981, but by that time, Sarah had no hard feelings over the love triangle with her own sister. As she once reportedly said, I introduced them. I'm Cupid. Sarah herself was married the year before, in 1980, to Neil Edmund McCorkwadale. The couple is still together today and has three children named Emily, Celia, and George, to whom Princess Diana was an aunt. After Diana's tragic death on August 31, 1997, Lady Sarah McCorkwadale accompanied Prince Charles to collect her body from Paris, where she passed. Sarah recited a poem at Diana's funeral and served as the president of the Diana, Princess of Wales Memorial Fund, which raised over £112 million for charities in the 15 years after Diana's death, before it closed in 2012. Royal Highness, I just wanted to offer my condolences. Lady Sarah McCorkwodale also gave evidence at the 2007 inquest into Princess Diana's death, which resulted in the decision that Diana and her companion Dodie Alphate had been unlawfully killed by a combination of the intoxicated driving by their chauffeur Henry Paul and the paparazzi photographers following them. Lady Sarah now resides in Grantham, Lincolnshire, and has made several appearances at royal gatherings in recent years including the weddings of both her nephews Princes William and Harry. Should I warn her? No. And let it be a surprise. She also, along with her sister Lady Jane Fellows, attended her great-nephew Archie's christening in July of 2019. Diana's sisters can be seen in the official portraits of the event, along with Prince Charles and his wife, Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall, Prince William and Kate Middleton, and Meghan Markle's mother, Doria Ragland. Everything between your ears, other than self-obsession, you know public displays like that horrify me. Everything I do seems to horrify Increasingly, you. yes. Hope you liked that video and if you haven't subscribed this channel, do subscribe it and we will see you in the next video.